Okay, uh, Opus 11 Violin, we're going to take a look at the bridge. Uh, now the bridge tuning, we'd like it to be 198 all the way across the top. And that includes on each side of each string. So there's a little change from one side to the other. And the string then would be the average of the two. And that'll hurt the tone a little bit if it isn't uh, the same on both sides. And that should match the center of the back. So it's very close. So the center. 198. 198. But all the other, the actual strings are a bit low, so let's listen as we strum across in the center. Okay. Uh, so now we want to um, bring these up and we'll find that the tap tone will be the same or want it to be the same, all the way down the front uh, curved side of the bridge. So under each string, the tone should be the same all the way down. And because these are low, then we need to raise it up by removing a little material. So we're going to try to find where it's relatively higher. So right here is relatively higher. So I'm going to use my Sharpen pocket knife. And just scrape there and see how it is now. Okay, let's go under the D string. Right on the upper lip here of this. Uh, and you have to forgive the shape of the uh, earlier experimentation. I was changing the shape of these, which I'm not doing now. For our purposes, it'll still be all right. So now let's even let's try this one. So right here and right in the middle here was a bit high. So this is just a little wood-backed uh, sanding board and nail file. Let's find that lower area. There's a little bit of a acoustical bulge here in the middle, so. Okay, it's here. string. Here right on the lip of the uh, kidney shape here there's a little bit of a high spot. Okay, so that was all went up a little bit. Now let's see um, where we're at here. We'll tap each string. Okay, now they're all four a little bit too high. So let's take them one at a time. We'll start with the G string. That's 198. So it's just up maybe um, Half a hertz, but half a hertz makes a difference. So we'll tap on both sides of the G string. So this is the side that's high. We're going to use our special file with the flat side, which goes toward the string. We're just going to take the lightest little dressing. You might angle it to the front side too. Now 
do the D string. Okay. Same thing, it's a little bit on this side. We're just going to take just the lightest little cut. Okay. Take a little more than that. on the inside is a little bit high. side bit is high. Can get in the flat, we don't want to ruin our strings. Okay, a little bit off the inside then. Even though it's 176 and this is 198. sound like they belong. It doesn't sound higher or lower. Okay. Okay, so that's the basic concept of uh, tuning a bridge. The tap tone will be the same under each string all the way to the bottom. That's what we want even though it's actually getting kind of tapering out and rounding and it's flat on the back side flat back here and vertical and here it has a bit of a rounded shape and it tapers off on both sides and uh, so if you can tap that all over the front be the same tone you want that to be 198 198 okay and that's basically the secret of uh, tuning the bridge and then every Things played through these strings will be beautiful. Okay, good.